I'm Ezra. I'm Kian. And this is our movie about how we can protect bottlenose dolphins. Let's tell you more about bottlenose dolphins. There are three types of bottlenose dolphins. Number one, common bottlenose dolphin. Number two, Indo-Pacific bottlenose dolphin. And number three, Burunin bottlenose dolphin. They live in groups called pods. An average pod has 10 to 30 members. Bottlenose dolphins communicate by using sounds. An average bottlenose dolphin weighs 1,100 pounds. We came up with a list of problems about bottlenose dolphins. La 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 la. Sometimes when bottlenose dolphins are swimming, they get stuck in the tuna heads. And they die. If this happens too much, all bottlenose dolphins will be gone. When people are driving boats and motorboats, they're polluting the water with the chemicals they use. If this happens too much, all bottlenose dolphins will die. Sometimes humans pour chemicals in the water that are harmful to the dolphins. If this happens too much, all dolphins will get sick and die. We came up with a list of solutions to those problems. The next thing I have on my list is tuna. Hmm. There's only dolphin safe tuna. What does that mean? It means that that, that no that no dolphin got harm doing this tuna. To prevent bottlenose dolphins from going extinct, only buy dolphin safe tuna. To prevent this problem, only ride your motorboats in waters that dolphins don't normally swim in. To prevent the water from being less polluted, so the bottomless dolphins can survive, if you're on the seashore, take out any trash or garbage you find in the sea, like this. That's the end. Bye! Thank you.